good day. The topic I would like to discuss is about racism. But before I start my topic, I have a few questions. Have you ever judged people because they are from a certain country or belong to a certain race? Have you ever felt every eye on you, knowing that you are being continually observed or judged? And if you and if you haven't been through this, just imagine how much you would like it. Not a bit, right? So I have been thinking about the current events right now, the tough times that we are dealing with today. I just wanted to speak of the majority. Those who are experiencing racism, we must facilitate different traits of thoughts. Because when we do this, we all gain. You know, racism is in our street, in our workplace, and at times even in our institutions. Sometimes it's within us, in the way we think, and even we don't realize it. It makes some people's life an uphill battle. It fed frustration and despair. It can scar a young person for a lifetime. We are surrounded by stories of racism. And even we, if we don't always see them, let's just say that racism is around us, even in our society. It, it doesn't always make the headline, but you know it is in there. The fact that adolescents can be the prey of this stereotypical situation just prove how terrible we humans can get. But, in the bright side, you see, we are now seeing the an outpouring solidarity with people protesting in the street against systemic and brutal racism. We need to fight against racism as well in our own institution and everywhere in the world. Because only if we are united, Black Lives Matter as a call for action. It made us look in the mirror and reflect about who we truly are and who we want to be as a community of free people. This time has come again. We must all be united and in racism. Thank you.